these are all the items we are going to be needing i have my ginger here of course i'm not going to finish all these this is a lot actually my hobby was the one that went shopping for me <laughs> hence why he bought all these i was like ah, ah did you pack all the ginger in the supermarket but anyways after the challenge i can still make use of it we have our cucumbers i have two bags here in total i have 11 pieces of fresh cucumbers i have my apples i have five of those and i have my fresh spinach i'm just going to be adding a handful in the blender each time i want to blend my smoothie and i have two packs of lemon here fresh lemon and i have three pineapples because this is a three day challenge so i have three of those yeah that's it <laughs> fingers crossed let's hope we are able to you know make it till the third day <laughs> drinking only smoothie for three days i don't know how it will go i've done it before for seven days so i don't think this three days one is going to be a challenge for me or it's going to be difficult oh, obviously it's a challenge but i don't think it's going to be difficult for me because like i said i've done it before for seven whole days drinking only smoothie but that one i used different types of um fruits and veggies but this one is just what you're seeing here right now so let's see how it goes good morning how are you all doing so it's the next day and today is officially day one of this smoothie cleanse challenge yesterday i thought i should show you guys all the items i'll be using for this challenge um when my hobby came back from the supermarket because he was the one that went shopping for me and so i i'm starting the challenge today and it's day one <laughs> so i'll be showing you guys in a bit how i prepare my um pineapple smoothie and i will drink the whole stuff that i've blended all throughout the day like whenever i feel hungry i just go and drink also i will not be doing any form of exercise during these three days yes i'm not going to be working out but i will be drinking my smoothie and then on the fourth day i will come up with my results i'm doing this challenge because i want to cleanse my system i want to de-bloat de i also i want to lose weight as well i've been fluctuating around 80 81 and i'm tired of this 80s i want to finally go down to 79 78 if i get down to 78 after this challenge i'll be very happy so let's see what will happen in the next three to four days okay i'm hoping to lose at least two kgs or even three if i lose three fine but two i'll be fine with two yeah so let me know if you're going to be doing this challenge with me and um without further ado let's go to the kitchen so i can show you my um stuff how i'm going to prepare the pineapple smoothie all right guys so i have already gone ahead to prep my ingredients for making my pineapple smoothie and i have my pineapple here one whole pineapple which i've already gone ahead to to peel the skin i have two cucumbers i have two lemons and i have this size of ginger and finally i'll be adding a handful of spinach just about this much just going to add it to the smoothie and blend so i'm going to cut up everything into smaller pieces so it can fit in my blender all right i'm done cutting up the fruits and in here i have the ginger the spinach the cucumber and i'm about to add the lemon juice the juice from the two lemons so i just used this to squeeze out the lemon juice and here is the pineapple everything cannot enter in the blender so i'm going to blend batch by batch 
just going to pour in the lemon juice wow i got a lot of juice from the lemon and i'm going to add some plain water just plain water to help with the blending process so it's about half of the blender so i'm going to blend this one first pour it out and then add the pineapple let me add more water here so yeah almost to the level of what i have in the blender Cheers guys, let's have our first meal. So with this, I'm not going to be doing any intermittent fasting. You guys know that I'm an intermittent faster, but I'm not going to be doing that for these three days. Like whenever I am hungry, I just come here, fill this up and drink, okay? The one I just put in the fridge now is going to last me all throughout today. Then tomorrow, I will repeat the same process of blending the stuff and drink all throughout the day and repeat the next day which is the third and final day so yeah cheers also yesterday i made um i made a meal for my family and hopefully it can last them for the rest of these three days because i don't want to be in the kitchen during this challenge cooking meals and perceiving the aroma and you know testing the meal because obviously when you are cooking you you need to test what you're cooking to make sure all the ingredients are okay so i'm not going to be doing that yay <laughs> i just made the meal yesterday and i also ate from it so even if i see them eating it now i will not be thrilled that much hopefully <laughs> so let's do this I love this combination so much. So good and so refreshing. Yes, yes, mm. so refreshing. It's so good. Also, I'll be drinking a lot of water. If I feel thirsty, I just drink water. If I feel hungry, I'll come pour 
in this um, container and drink. morning guys it's the next day day two and i'm starting off the day with a cup of coffee it's black plain coffee if you can see i don't want to spill it here but yeah no sugar no milk added to it so i'm going to be drinking this sipping on this because i'm i'm craving for something warm yesterday i've been drinking cold stuff and i was craving food a lot okay yeah that reminds me um let me update you guys what happened yesterday in the morning when i started this challenge i was so you know happy and into it when you start off something newly you get so excited very excited that was how excited i was yesterday and then around 12 the hunger kicked in i was craving food it's not like i was hungry like it's so weird i wasn't hungry but at the same time i was craving for different types of food i was sitting down here all day thinking of food craving for food like i nearly gave up yesterday even when i served my my family yesterday i dished out their food and as they were eating i was just looking at them like <sighs> who sent me a message like who told me to go on this so i said you can you can just eat and call this a quit nobody will know <laughs> and my hobby was busy making jest of me he was like come and sniff the food once you sniff it like this you will be satisfied I just left the kitchen for them. I came and sat here. I was thinking of food. So that was the experience I had yesterday. But other than craving for food, I felt so good. Also, let me put this out there. Let me put this out there. If you're going to be doing this challenge with me please make sure to do it while staying very close to a toilet because you're going to be pooping pooping a lot i'm sorry this is too much information but i guess everybody poop like who doesn't poop so you're going to be peeing a lot and you're going to be pooping a lot like yesterday i went like five times and i'm not talking about pee so you can imagine what it it was with peeing. I was just peeing like a, a pregnant woman that is about to pop. So please be sure to do this while staying very close to the toilet. For me, I'm not going anywhere, so it is easier for me. Just so you know, okay? So that is it. I've not had my first smooth, first smoothie this morning. This is currently eight, three minutes after eight a.m. So I'm going to sip on this and then um, whenever I feel hungry, I'll just go and start blending the pineapple stuff. I've not blended it yet. I'm yet to do that. And I, I still have one more day to go. I can't wait to end this already. I just want to eat warm slash hot food. Like I'm craving for warm cooked food. Yeah. So I'll talk to you guys tomorrow and let Bye. you know how it's going so far. Bye. Daddy. <laughs> Daddy. Daddy. The man that was telling me to come and sniff the food. That once I sniff it, I will feel full. Like, look at him there. He, he's just coming back from dropping the kids off school. Look at him. He was making a jest of me yesterday. You don't know how to do that kind of thing. You need to... You need to prepare the food very well. Mm -hmm. Arrange it, set it, and be looking at us. 
fact that at times you even give us water to drink. So that we will enjoy it, you will be doing like this. Do you see the, the type of man I married? Have you people seen it? Hey, no problem. You are telling me good in the evening this time. <laughs> good evening. You good night. Talk to you guys tomorrow. Bye. Coffee gone. And yeah, I forgot to tell you guys something when I was in the living room. I lost exactly one kg this morning. I weighed myself this morning and I'm down one kg. Like I'm one kg lighter. My midsection went down a bit like my tummy feels so much flatter this morning so it's a win-win for me let's see how much i'm able to lose tomorrow <laughs> I, I i understand that as the day goes by it gets harder to lose more weight so i don't know what will happen tomorrow but at least i've gone down one kilogram and that's exciting for me it's really exciting so i'm here now to start making my this thing my smoothie and i will show you guys once i'm done blending day two smoothie almost ready i have exactly what i showed you yesterday in this bowl i've gone ahead to peel and cut them yeah and here is my um, lemon juice everything set and ready to go into the blender This is what I have left the two nights and it's not even much so I guess I will just drink this and drink water then go to bed. By the way, I know you might be wondering where are the apples I showed you in the beginning of this video. Guys, this is what I have left. Can you imagine my kids rushed those apples that same day that I showed you like after I was done showing you guys the ingredients I was going to be using or the items, they came back from school and <laughs> the rest is history. You already know what happened. So this is the only one left. I might just drink this, eat the apple and go to bed. I don't know yet. I don't feel like eating this apple. But if I end up eating it, I will let you guys know. All gone. <laughs> I'm not going to be eating the apple because I'm okay. Like, I'm tired of cold food. I want cooked food, warm food. <laughs> so, I'm okay with this. I'm just going to drink water and go to bed. Good night, guys. See you tomorrow morning. Bye. Good morning, guys. It's another day, day three. Yay, I'm happy. Today is the last day of this challenge and I will be showing you guys my results tomorrow morning. But so far, so good. Yesterday wasn't that hard. It wasn't as difficult as they won. And I hope that today is going to be even more better, a lot better than the previous days. And as you can see, I'm starting off my day again with another cup of coffee because I'm I want something warm to start off my day before I jump into drinking the the cold stuff. Honestly, I at this point I want to eat. I just want to eat cooked food, but I guess I have to finish up with this challenge and then I can get to eat tomorrow. Also, I've gone down a kilo this morning well not exactly a kilo it's 0 0.900 grams and i'm happy with that i'm happy with the 900 grams it's almost a kilo in fact let's just generalize it i've lost a kilo this morning <laughs> and i'm i'm excited seeing what i saw on the scale this morning like what 
Okay, I know a lot of you will be like, it's just water weight. You are losing water weight. Leave it like that. Even if it is water weight or fat weight, or... it's a win win, you guys. Even if it is water weight, uh -huh, it is no longer in my body. Is that not why we are doing this? To get rid of the excess water. So, I'm, I'm actually, I'm happy with my results. I'm going to drink my coffee. And <laughs> go make my breakfast, lunch, dinner, and snacks. <laughs> it's not even funny. Like remembering right now that I still have to drink up to four bottles today. Three to four bottles today. First day was four bottles. Yesterday, three and a half. Today, I don't know how many bottles. But just thinking of it now, I'm already exhausted. I'm tired of drinking that. But today is the last day, which is a good thing. And I can't wait to eat tomorrow morning. <laughs> I can't wait. Anyway, see you guys tomorrow with my results. And um, okay, let me just end this vlog here because I might not. In fact, I will not be coming on camera tomorrow to talk. I will just show you my results and, you know, call it a quit or call it a day. So, if you are going to be doing this, like I said before, please be sure to stay close or stay near a toilet so you don't disgrace yourself <laughs> and um, this I would say it will make you feel very hungry I mean the smoothie you're going to feel extremely hungry you will be craving for a lot of food for sure and surprisingly I've not been feeling so down like tiredness or anything I just I don't want to do anything to stress myself but the energy is still there like every morning I wake up feeling so strong and energized or energetic so um, I don't know our bodies are not the same maybe you might feel um, weak or a little bit a little bit tired but for me i'm okay i'm good just that i'm always craving for food and hungry as well that's the downside so far that i experienced but if you try it out uh, just come back and let me know how it went for you yeah see you guys tomorrow morning i don't want this video to be too long See you tomorrow with my results. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye. <laughs>
subscribe down below and i'll see you all in my next one take care of yourself bye